All right, back for number eight, attenuation by various tissues. <clears throat> so attenuation means the reduction in intensity of the x-ray beam as a result of absorption, scatter, and divergence. <clears throat> Excuse me. Differential absorption, um, different objects absorb radiation differently. The thickness of the body part will also be a factor. More dense areas of the body will attenuate more x-rays. If you think of abdomen versus chest, the chest has lungs, which are mainly filled with air. Uh, the abdomen has more dense organs and fluid-filled areas. The type of tissue determined by the atomic number. So the higher the atomic number um, of the body part, the greater the attenuation of the beam and the greater the biological effect. So if you look over on the chart over here, um, bone is at a 14 atomic number, um, and then it gets sort of higher as we go. So barium um, is at a 56, and then lead would be at an 82. So as it increases in atomic number, the attenuation also increases. And then KVP. And just remember, your KVP is the energy of your beam, and the KVP also uh, determines the penetrability or the penetrating power of your beam. So if you think of barium work, we increase our KVP at least to that 110 um, level for most areas because we have to use a higher KVP to be able to um, work with the barium that's in the patient. Subject density. Would you be able to rank these options in order as far as subject density? Um, from sort of least dense to most dense, could you do it by attenuation? What would, um, you know, attenuate more or less? So if you look over here, so air doesn't really attenuate, right? It, the x-rays pass right through, it shows up as black. Fat will attenuate a small amount. That's where we're gonna have kind of a dark gray. Other tissues and then bone. Bone attenuates a lot because um, it shows up that bright white color. Also, just keep in mind, um, attenuation has kind of, or these densities have an indirect relationship with exposure. So air, it's not gonna absorb much, but it's gonna probably penetrate through easier, meaning it's gonna reach your image receptor. 